All right, in this video, I want to show you some tips on how to close the browser tabs easily. Suppose you accidentally close the browser tabs, no problem. Press this shortcut key, Control, Shift, and T to reopen the closed tabs. That's it. And then if you close the tabs and you if you want to open a new tab, press Control, T. That's it. And tip number three is if you want to open the browser in private mode, Control, Shift, N, and you're going to open the browser in private mode. That's it. And if you want to go to a website like google.com, let's say you're going to google.com and then uh, you search something, but then you see you can press, you type an address, let's say you go to msn.com, okay, and it loads. Now you scroll here and there, and then what do you do? You close the tab and then what you want to do is use this shortcut key for example like you mouse around here and there and then yeah you go here and then you go back right you can always use a shortcut to open the previous tab and you can close the tab and you can pretty much do everything in Windows machine right so let's say Mm, you right click and then you want to see the source code of this page you see view page source right you can simply press ctrl u and you can see the source code so that's the easy part there and again when you want to right click and you usually do a lot of things using mouse and I think using keyboard is more e easy so if you say Alt L, Alt D. You can go to the browser toolbar. So it's all easy, guys. So so that's the thing about that. And in YouTube, if you want to uh, enable the restrictive mode, this is how you do that. So click there, three dots there, and then you can toggle back. So that's pretty easy right there. You don't have to log into YouTube to do that. And then let's go to google.com and just search for something, anything. Suppose you say test internet speed. And what you need to do is if you want to search for the exact word, right now I'm just seeing results like that are not relevant. So all what you need to do is add a double quote to the beginning and the end of the search word and Google will exactly match that text and you see the exact text you typed matches and it displays and it displays only that exact matched text so that's one tip you need to follow if you want to if you are searching for the exact text in Google keywords see you found seven keywords but if I don't if I just search without the double double quotes it doesn't really get me the right result relevant result right so yeah so use double code to search more accurately right to get the exact result that you wanted so that's all guys this video helps you hope it helps you so if you like this video right subscribe and I will post more tips like this and you can learn and save time. Thank you.